Hey guys, this is Avenger from uh, GTA Island Life again, and uh, this time I... Okay, so the last video I made a video about guns, and uh, this is also going to be a video about guns, but this time the taser. Um, so the taser is going to be your... Uh, well, it should be your main weapon, your main policing weapon, because it's a non-lethal way of taking down uh, any suspects or criminals. Um, and here to deal with actually shooting criminals and people, uh, once you shoot them, uh, they die, and when they respawn, any crimes that they committed last life does not apply to them because they they are dead. They are starting out a new life. So, for example, if someone's wanted for murder or for killing a cop and then kill them, you can't go back to spawn and then arrest them when they spawn. Uh, so, pretty much, if you're trying to get someone and then you're trying to take them out and uh, arrest them, well, you'll need to actually tase them and then restrain them, and then take them to prison, and then arrest them. Uh, killing them is, you're killing them, but it doesn't really give you the satisfaction of seeing them put away in jail for their crimes. Um, so, it's a pretty effective weapon, and you, pretty much you should have it on you at all times, no matter what. Uh, and I would rather have police officers have tasers on them than actual lethal pistols, shotguns, and other forms of uh, lethal weapons. Okay, so here's what getting tased actually looks like, or here's what shooting actually looks like. Um, since I really have no one on the server, on the server at the moment to tase me, uh, I actually set up a command to tase myself. Uh, but, okay, so tasing, someone actually looks, just looks like the, shooting it, looks like this. So there's a sound and everything, and you, it just says you tased and then the name of the person. That's, that's all that happens. You get a nice little particle effect. Uh, but th what's really cool is what happens to the person who gets tased. So this is the command I set up to actually tase myself. Uh, okay. Alright, and then bam. So as you can see, I'm blind and I'm pressing W right now and I can't move. I am, I, I cannot move right now. I am mob immobile. I have slowness and blindness and I cannot move. I am stunned and uh, if I try to hurt anyone while I am tased, uh, I will not deal any damage. I cannot shoot guns while I am tased. I pretty much cannot do anything while I am tased. I am stunned. Let's do that again. Get the nice sound. I'm blind. And I cannot move. I can jump. That's pretty much just about it. And I can't. I can't attack. I can't do anything. I'm completely stunned. And uh, this is very useful for police officers when they're trying to, you know. Uh, just get it when they're trying to lock down a crime scene and they want to uh, restrain any potential suspects and those suspects aren't being cooperative so they have to restrain them well they can just tase them and uh, and then restrain them because to actually tase a player remember they need uh, to actually restrain a player remember they need to be they need to be stunned or tased uh, stunning is when you're using your, sh your your fist and you just hit someone and then it does the exact same thing as tasing it just stuns them um, and that's really, you know, if you're right next to someone. Uh, tasing is pretty much whenever you're uh, at a long range distance and you're, you know, trying to take someone out. So that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this and are excited for more updates in the future. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, like, and favorite. Uh, I'm gonna, <laughs> I've been working on this since, uh, or until 3 a.m., so I'm kind of tired at the moment. Uh, so, yeah, 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 I hope you guys enjoyed it, bitches. Um, and yeah, f like, favorite, subscribe, leave a post on our development thread, and yeah, fuck you, bitches.